Drew, this might be an obvious question, but if what's important now has been part of the process for the last four years, what's important now after going 10-0? Uh, I think Syracuse. Uh, you know, big one in Yankee Stadium next week, and you know we'll take this night to enjoy this with our families and get down on the field with them. But um, you know we got a great football team uh, coming to beat us next week. You you came in here five years ago with safety, and if memory serves, that was a bit of a focus safety. And now you're an inside linebacker with a bit of experience at inside linebacker. How is you, How have you changed as a football player, especially in the last ten weeks, eleven weeks? Yeah, I mean, I've gone through three position changes, um, <laughs> but, you know, it was all like, you know, what the team needed, like the team needed me at safety at that time, um, and as we've kind of evolved and, and, you know, recruited guys that can play back there, you know, it's allowed me to move kind of into more of my natural position, um, and, you know, I'm still learning a lot at Buck, it's my first year in the box, and so it's been great going, you know, working next to a guy like Tavon, who's, you know, done it for his whole career. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm just constantly learning. What were your biggest concerns about this game going into tonight, Florida State, and what they had to offer? I mean, they just have athletes all over the field. Um, you know, they're just, they're so dynamic. I noticed that, like, you know, I'd be going to, you know, tackle guy on an angle, and he could put his foot in the ground in a split second and be back three yards. And so just the dynamic at the wide receiver position, running back position, um, you know, whenever they have players like that, you have to execute and do your job or, you know, the game could be closer than you want.